do hope that you all had a good ride down. Uh, just for us, uh, I guess I'm saying right, linguistics, the language, we call it crites. All right. But again, some people call it crits. We hear it all the time in the news, it's ready to get the weather. If it's a tornado, it comes through crits. A lot of people are hard prepared because they live in crites. But anyhow, welcome to Patrick County. Uh, as she uh, indicated, I hope all of y'all did have a good ride. Actually, what I'll do is I'll pass out one of our books that we have published this year. Uh, uh, it's called, it's our Patrick County Magazine. Virginia created Patrick County in 1791. But the family still is very involved and engaged. Nancy Susan Reynolds, who was RJ's daughter, gave Virginia Tech the property, which at that time was 717 acres. Back in 1969, she spent a million dollars restoring the home and outbuildings back to what they would have been when they were built. And so it's very community oriented. Um, we also work with our Virginia Tech partners to help us with different projects. And so we're so glad y'all are here to help with projects here in the county. D. Hart Stewart should be in this area. And those on the Bay River Trail in the uh, corner closest to the door. Some of you, this is the first time that you've done a community project um, where you have intentionally been trying to dig information out of people. And then um, on the community uh, folks that are here, if you could join the students with the um, particular parks, then they can pick your brain as you're picking over your lunch. We did hear a lot about how individuals feel about it for themselves. Ask them about how recreation is done by their kids, by their grandkids, by their friends, different age groups, different types of activities that people do or don't do or say they'd like to do but perhaps don't have a place to do that yet. So you're trying to kind of just get as much information as you can so you can think it over on that long drive back to Blacksburg before you meet as your group to go, now what do we do? Okay, we have um, uh, nine groups. That means three different groups for each park um, and two vans for each park. You do a lot of work. Why don't we take care of the trails, K9, 109. And uh, we've done about 16 of them, but we didn't really like ranch food. And we migrated up here. She plays old time music. Excellent. And the trails, we live seven miles. Is that something that could change, or is that something that you envision staying the same? This is a stay the same. So, I think that might be a good question. If you want to introduce yourself <laughs> and jump in with yes. your, your vision. Um, again, we need needs to stay simple with low maintenance or low and easy upkeep, uh, but at the same time, something for everybody. Uh, with the bike thing, with a couple of times a year, they'll have a big bike ride. Um, even with the trail system, we had talked about maybe trying to do a, uh, a ruck race. So we do like say about a 12 mile course with the rucksack, uh, given the community's history of... Uh, we're, we're not set on that, you know, having sort of a, a liquor thing. Okay. You know, but... uh, it, it originated with, of course, you've got um, Cripple Creek and a lot of the bootlegging history, and that's kind of where a lot of NASCAR got its roots in. Yeah, there they're, they're really by my house. They're, <laughs> they're some of the best single track trails in the state of Virginia that nobody knows about. Yeah, we need they to really are, more. They're spectacular. TV project, so it's all online. Um, I assume the names are on there, but at least the layout. Garden loop. Hmm. I think all those names are going to change. And then the other entrance being that way by the soccer field. 